All right. Hey, thanks for tuning in. This th this particular battle is what I call the comedy of errors. This was a uh, very rare battle. Um, I got to uh, be a part of it. It's it's hilarious um, a little bit at the beginning, but near the end, you're just not gonna believe how much stuff goes wrong, and we still won. So you can see it's a tier five, tier four battle. I'm in the Wyoming. It's a great, uh, great tier four battleship. Lays out a lot of pain. And I am going to uh, play a bit with the uh, playback speed to get past some of the more boring parts. But we've got uh, most of our guys are going to go for C. And a few are going to go for A. Pretty typical breakup. But uh, you see uh, right, in, right in the middle of your screen there, that destroyer and that cruiser? Well, <laughs> keep watching. Mr. Alnut in VKV, I think that was his name. Watch this. Crash! Not even one minute into the game. No enemies. And we have a crash. Uh, thank God for Allstate. So off they go. We've all crashed. Yeah, we've been there before. But it's still kind of fun to poke a little fun. Alright, so. You can see we've got five friendlies going for C. Three friendlies going for A. Pretty typical unfolding of the battle here. So I haven't landed any hits, and there's a destroyer moving in close, but uh, that's going to change here. Landed my first hit, but this salvo really rocks. Boom! Citadel. Took out half his health. This is a great ship when you get close. Now look to the upper left of your screen, that uh, ship that's going to run aground. Ooh. We've all been there, but God, it feels just like uh, you feel like such a rookie when you do something like that. Anyway, going for uh, this uh, destroyer, he's too darn close for comfort. Enemy has lost one. We have just lost one. Now, when you run aground, 3.6 kilometers, or actually two kilometers for him, away from a destroyer, you know what's coming. Yeah. yeah, you'll see it on your screen any minute. Yep, all those torps are going right into him and he can't do anything about it. Boom! Ouch! Oh, that's gotta hurt. So now, it's, uh, oh, we just lost another destroyer. So now it's me and one cruiser against four enemies. Oh boy. And, uh, let's face it, a battleship is not what you want when it's four against one. Especially when two of them are destroyers. Well, I just landed another citadel, took out half his health, and two more citadels, and he's like on no health at all. Gosh, I want to take him out so bad, but look behind me, man. I got two destroyers coming at me. This is not good. This is not good at all. And we just lost the other cruiser up by sea cap, which means I am all alone. And here comes the first torpedo salvo. Ouch. Oh, not good. So this uh, cruiser that's almost dead, I really want to take him out. I really do. I don't think I'm going to get the chance because there's just so much going on around me. I do get a shot off, but uh, another cruiser throws his body in front of the salvo and takes the hit. What a guy. And uh, this pretty much does me in. Yeah, there's nothing left. But I did take out that damn destroyer. Okay, enough of the serious stuff. Time for some fun. So, basically, there's a uh, three enemies up here at sea cap and uh, these are our last two guys down here by a cap
One is named uh, Triumph. Speed up here. Okay, we notice a battleship moving in to the left. I think this is Triumph. Yeah, really close to us. The other one is Air Jellyfish. So Triumph is doing the right thing. He's trying to get behind cover. Air Jellyfish also smartly sneaks out and sends off some torps. But watch what Triumph does. This is... This, the, the, this goes... I, I don't know how to, to, to say what the heck happened here. I don't know how this happened. But he goes right in. And these guys crash into each other. How do you guys crash into each other on a wide open map when there's only two of you? Oh dear. Well anyway, there's a Dan A up there who's on very low health. He'll be an easy kill. Meanwhile, Air Jellyfish is backing up. He knows there's a battleship back there. He knows. So what do you think he's going to do? They keep shooting at the Danae with their guns. They might get him here in a minute. Air Jellyfish just lost half of his health. The Danae is gone. Now, I bet you're thinking, he's going to ram. He's going to ram. That's not what's going to happen. I bet you can't guess what's going to happen. He sends his torps, but he's so close they don't have time to arm. Oh, no! So now he is, like, throwing rock distance away from a battleship that is very near firing, and if he fires at that range, it's all over. It's all over. But instead, the battleship takes a shot at Triumph, and Triumph does redeem himself here, and you can see why. Bam and bam, he takes out that battleship. So, way to go, Triumph. Way to make up for staring nose first into a, an island and cutting off your only ally. <laughs> okay, so we got Air Jellyfish and Triumph who are now taking on these two enemies. The last two. It's two against two. And of course the destroyer is the way to go here. They have no armor so you want to focus fire on the destroyer easiest enemy to take out. So off they go. We're finally up and rolling. Even though each uh, of our two friends here only is down to less than half of health, uh, they are finally moving. And they're shooting, and they seem to be organized. Well, that's, that's cool. Glad to see things moving along. But that's not going to last. That's not going to last. Nope. It's not. The near ship to us is uh, uh, Air Jelly. Watch what happens to him. This is unbelievable. Now he, he and uh, Triumph, they're, they're doing their job. They're blowing away at uh, this uh, destroyer. And the destroyer is gone. But uh, Air Jellyfish here was definitely tunnel visioning, uh, visioning and crash. And crash and the boat drifts into shore. He is not gonna get out of that. He is not gonna get out of that, So He is basically stuck hard aground. Not soft, but hard. Meanwhile, Triumph here is almost dead. I don't think he's looking where he's going. No. Nope. But he does get a couple of torps off, and then now he runs aground. Unbelievable. You can't write, you can't make this stuff up. You cannot make this stuff up. He does land some torps on the enemy who's almost dead, but look at what Air Jellyfish does while stuck. Boom! <laughs> Absolutely unbelievable. What a match. Yes, we did win. Triumph got killed in that final melee, and that left just our last hope, Air Jellyfish, who was hard on ground. And he was not going to get off that rock. Not happening. So, 
so you can see this is one of those rare games that just makes everything worthwhile. Yep, definitely made my Saturday night. Thanks for watching, guys. You take care. Stay safe and have fun.